Pros at gmail dot com. Oh, okay. Yeah, I'll search for that one there. Hello? Oh, I'm still here. Sorry, I'm just loading into this account now. Um, yeah, just so, can I confirm the, the social last? Okay. So, Julie, this account, um, it's limited. Uh, we're looking for a bit of information about a bank that's on here. Um, your Bureau of the Public Debt, um, or back of the team, has limited your account request in a bank statement. You said they've, um, you say the bank has limited it? No, 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 not, not the bank or back office team has. So they've reviewed your account and has limited it and uh, because they're requesting a bank statement from that bank that you added. They're requesting a bank statement? Yes, in order for you to gain full access back to your account, they're requesting a bank statement. What do they need a bank statement for? They're just looking for you to confirm uh, that you have um, not only just a legitimate bank, but also that you're the owner of that account. Um, so we can see that it is your bank, truly. So they want me to come up with a bank statement. It's my, um, th that's my commercial trust account. So, I don't have any, like, online access to it. It's in Chicago. Okay. So, it, it's the account ending in 5612. So, uh, I'm not too sure um, how you can get a bank statement for it. What, it's just I'm reading what the back office team has said, and that's what they're requesting for you to be. Okay, to so why, would, why are they requesting that? I, I already said that to you, Julie, so they want to make sure that this is not only just a legitimate bank, but that you're the owner of the Why bank. do they think it is not a legitimate bank? It's not that they don't think that's the two possible why they're asking for this information. Okay, I'm sorry, I'm just confused. So why do they think that it's not a legitimate bank? It's, so I, I've never said that they don't think it. The request is... So they can prove that you're either the account holder for that bank account or that it is a legitimate bank. Because so, I, I never had this problem. Money. I'm trying to find out. I never had that problem before with my other account. So why do they want to check that one? Um, I don't know why they are checking this one over any other account that you have. Well, it, how can I find out? Well, it's not that you can find it. They're just basically saying... No, I'm asking a question. I'm asking a question. How can I find out as to why they I need to check that? The why do you do, Julie? I'm sorry? So it's, not a, it's not a basis of why. They've given me a reason why. Okay. The, I, I'm saying I'm asking you, um, how can I find out why? What popped up? What's the issue? Not, you're never going to be able to find out how this came about. Well, you, so, okay. So you say I'm not going to be able to find out how this came about? I've already told you why. You're just not accepting it, Julie. No, I'm asking. I, I'm sorry. Account. My apologies. I guess I'm not understanding. Okay. I'm trying to figure out why. So what makes them think that it's not my account? Okay. So at the very start, I said to you that they reviewed your account, okay? And when okay. They reviewed your account. They noticed that that bank. So they just pick. So account. they just pick me randomly, or I mean, what? You know, they, there had to be some kind of reason based off of this. This is the reason why, because this came up as invalid or something like that. 
Um, I, I don't think that they know that information. That's why you... Okay, well, how can we... What can we do to find out? I, you see, what you're trying to find out is not something that we can provide you. Our back office team, who deals with government... If you're asking... Issues, I'm sorry, say, say that one more time. Yeah, so you're asking me why this happened. What triggered this to happen? Correct. Okay, so that means... So that means that you would, if you don't know something, you probably would put me on hold and go find out if it's above your pay grade. No, no, it's, it's not. I okay, so it's then you would find out, you would ask the question. But the question that you're asking is not something I'd be able to provide you. Or okay, so who can provide me with that answer? Nobody. Julie, the question you're asking is what triggered our security system or our back office agents to... Yeah, I mean, so it just comes out of the... It just comes out of the air? Is that what you're saying? I mean, that's somebody... There have to be... There would have to be somebody there saying, okay, well, this popped up because that didn't match or that didn't match. So my question is, I want to know... Or is there a super? Is there a supervisor available? Nobody's going to take this call because this is my job. This is my job to tell you. Okay, well then, well then if you don't know the answer, if you don't know the answer. Julie, you're trying to get me to disclose information that we can't. You're disclosing information about me, sir. I'm not asking you to disclose information about anybody else. I'm asking you to disclose information about me. No, about me. my situation. It is about me. Who is it? So it's not about me? I'm sorry. Right. So uh, what I'm saying is something would have had to trigger it for them to ask that question, correct? Okay. So how can I... Okay. So... How can I find out? If you saying that it came from a certain department, I'm sorry. Go ahead. We cannot tell you that information because that would be disclosing how we do our practices, how we discover. Okay, so you are saying that you cannot tell me because it would be disclosing how you do business. That's exactly it. That would be disclosing how PayPal investigates our back office team work. Okay. And what's your and, and okay, and what's your name? My name is Patty. Patty? Yes. Like P A T T Y? No, sorry. P A D for that the D for that the Y for Yang. So P A D Y. P as in Paul, A as in Apple, D as in dog, Y as in yes. Two D. Okay. Okay. So almost like the woman's name. Okay. Um. Well, is there a fax number or any way that I can get in contact with them? Because I, I just, I'm just curious. Yeah. To, to provide information to them. Like, I can, of course, give you information to provide, like, bank statements to them, because that's how it works. Yeah, go ahead. Go ahead and provide me with that. That'd be great. Perfect. Um, is the link to upload the information? Can I provide that link to you by email, or would you like me just to call that at you? You know what? I don't have internet. Can you, uh, is there any way you can provide me with a, uh, fax number? Yeah, I'd give you a fax number to your back office. That, just a moment. That'd be great. Whenever you're ready, I can call it at you. I'm sorry? Yeah, I, I'm ready. Are you ready to take the fax number then? Correct. Okay, so it would be 303. 303. 395. Yeah. Okay. 28. 28. 28. 28. Okay. okay. Um, what else? Because this is kind of hard getting you guys <laughs> on the phone. Okay. And you say you will not, they will not disclose to me as to what triggered it. 100%. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Thank you so much. And you have a wonderful day, Patty. You too, Judy.
Thank you. Peace. Bye-bye.